morning students welcome to this video uh, previous class we will discuss about the new lessons you know the getting to know plants you know so that lesson you have learned about that what are the parts of your plants you know like the other stems and leaves and fruits or flower so these are the parts of your plant so today we are going to talk about the next sub topic the structure of leaves you know the leaf is very important part of your plant because the leaf it prepare the own food okay wow. so now we are going to start about the structure of your leaf okay wow. now we are going to talk about the structure of your leaf okay do you see the different kinds of plants around us you know definitely do you see the different kinds of plants around us okay do you see the different kinds of leaves also around us you know in or all, all parts of your leaves you know like that or all the leaves the same size and color no definitely the different definitely the different okay see the different kinds of leaves okay ma to see it is one kind of leaf and this is one kind of leaf and this is one kind of leaf so that definitely the leaf shape size and color also a different from one leaf to another leaf so what you know definitely the shape and size the shape and size and color itself may be different from one leaf to another leaf okay now the first one that what is the meaning of that pto you know so pto first this is the leaf you know the leaf you know the part of your leaf the part of your leaf the bud attached to the stem that part is called pto the pto means nothing but the part of your leaf which is which is attached to the stem so that is your stem that is your leaf you know so bud will attach to the stem that region is called what pto that region is called what the pto that is the leaf that leaf is attached with the stem you know like this like you know so that part is known as called pto that part is known as called what pto and next one lamina so the lamina means nothing but the broad green part of the leaf you know the lamina means nothing but the broad the broad green part of the leaf the broad the broad green part of the leaf part of the leaf that is called the lamina okay so the lamina means nothing but the full the leaf fully look like in that broad green structure you know fully the green okay what so that is called lamina so lamina means nothing but the broad green part of your leaf is known as called lamina is known as called what lamina okay so can you identify this part of the leaf okay so what is this so this is the pto this is the pto and this green part of the leaf that is called what lamina that is called what lamina so next one activity you know let us to know, know that leaf better by taking it impression impression means what pressing impression means what pressing if you thought that leaves cannot sign it's an odd activity did you know whether our leaves have some veins or not okay so that is one of the activity cannot sign here it's an activity with the help of or to with the help of leaves and try to do this activity okay how you do this activity okay so take one paper or leaf take one white color paper on your leaf first put your leaf put your leaf under your white sheet of paper put your for it this is the 
the inside that lamina is look like in the net like shape that is called the reticular venation do you see any that reticular venations in the leg no so the some base is present in the the parallel of the both side the parallel on the both side of the midrib that is called the the parallel venation the parallel venation means nothing but is your both side of equal that is called what the parallel venation okay so this is one of the very good example of the parallel venation so here this is your midrib okay what the some base is located in the state in the both side state in the both side that is a uh, parallel venation that is a parallel venation okay well so it is one kind of activity whenever you free you look at the ground or you look at the trees okay well don't pick the leaves okay well don't remove the leaves from the plant just you observe you do observe the different kinds of plants is Present in around us. Okay, what? You observe the different kinds of leaves. Okay, what? Then you mention the parts of your leaves. Okay, what? And you draw that and you identify. You know, then you identify that particular variation and the parallel variation. Okay, what? Then you write the name of the plants. Okay, what? So which plants are in the reticular venations and which plant are in the parallel venations? Okay, ma. Just you observe that uh, plant leaf. Okay, ma. Don't remove the leaf from the plants. Okay, ma. Just you observe and you find out the parts of your plants uh, like the what is the meaning of petiole and lamina and veins or nutrients. And you can find out and you write the name of the plants like the reticular venation plants and the parallel venation plants. Okay, that is one of the easy activity. You can whenever you free, you can try to do this activity. Okay, thank you.